Hello, welcome back. Last time I cleared out the mummies and statues in Queen's Palace. Got myself a Queen's Staff or whatever. And there's some sort of snake pit in there that I want to tackle next. So that's what we're going to do. Where does this bring me? Nowhere convenient, right? Back to the tower, back to the tower. Alright, well, we know how that walk goes. Gonna have to do it again. Alright, before I put on the Widow equipment, let's look one more time at this. There's something up high. It might be a crystal. It's way over there. There's definitely an item there, but it's too low resolution for me to tell what it is. Like, I can't climb up this waterfall somehow. So yeah, just another one of these items out of reach, like that bird nest, back in the church or whatever. No idea how to get to it. I'm still kind of curious how much damage these flames do. Probably a lot. Having to walk through that fire gauntlet on the way here, that sure did chip down my health a whole lot, but it's okay because I go through an MP reset here, so I can cast the healing spell pretty much as many times as I want, and... Oh, okay, so that's how much the fire hurts. Not much at all. I wonder if I could just run through there. Maybe it only didn't hurt because it was going away because I had the stuff on. Right, so... Uh, right now, I prefer the... This, or that. Lost train of thought, don't worry about it. Anyway, so, I go in here, I go through a square room, I turn left and there's a snake pit. I think the square room is through this door. Getting shot at, I heard that bowstring being drawn. That's fine. Square room. Other door. There's gonna be a grate here of some sort, yes. And the door to the snake pit must be this one. Alright, so, snakes. I, my crystal vials are full, right? Yes, okay. Alright, so, let's not just run through here all gung-ho. Let's slow down and deal with problems as they come, if possible. So, a snake is hissing in my direction. Alright, you're dead. I have a feeling this is infinitely spawning. There are little holes in the wall. Ooh. What am I seeing through there? Is that what a snake nest looks like? This one is less distinct. Now hold on. Am I seeing all the way through to the big snake over there? I wonder. I want to try inserting a bolt into that. Okay, well that was perfect aim, but nothing really happened. Alright, well, I tried. Nothing really happened. Okay, so I was on the crystalline blade. Got ice clad equipped, got it. I never remember which shield I had equipped. Ah, but that makes it clear. I think I'm all in blessed equipment now. I don't think there are any set bonuses in this game, but... The equipment itself is quite good. Alright, both at once. There we go. And then you. Am I hearing more hissing? I am. Do I want to deal with it? Not really. Should I? Probably. So dealing with it involves turning around. That is the hardest action for whoever I'm playing as to do, apparently. Mm -hmm. Yeah, this doesn't seem to be depleting. Every time I turn around, there's a new snake. Yeah, alright. Doesn't seem to be depleting. So, big snake. Over here. Over... Over here? Yeah, here we go. Two big snake. Alright, so you got a poison breath attack, I see. So that's what was happening to me that one time. Alright, now don't I have... I have a thing that resists poison. Right? Uh, not in this slot, in that slot. Yeah. How much does it protect? All the way? So let me use an antidote. So now I won't be poisoned again? It does seem kind of like that. Problem is, okay, I guess I just gotta take this and go forward. I don't know what else I could really do here because you are filling the entire room with that. However, I'm also dying? 
Why can't I cast right now? I'm trying to cast and I cannot. Oh, I only have 16 MP left, right, because my thing is so low. Alright, so this is... this cannot be right. Like, something is going wrong here. I'm gonna leave this room for a moment. Maybe... okay, so here's an idea. Alright, yeah, I'm not feeling very protected against poison. Okay, so several things. First of all, that armband is not strong enough to protect against that. Second of all, I want some MP. Third of all, I got an idea. So let's drink a healing water to get some MP. Cast a healing spell to get some HP. I want perhaps... Okay, let's equip the Queen's Staff. Uh, that would be here. Maybe that's specifically what this is for. It's one-handed. Increases magic power by how much? Can I see? Magical 83 out of 73. I guess by 10, maybe? Yeah, I guess by 10, maybe. Okay. So now, uh, for my spell... This feels like a situation where Eclipse might actually be good. If I can lay this down and have it hurt you... you oh, I'm paralyzed. For how long? Until I'm dead? Yeah, kinda. Okay, fine. Okay, yeah, I am just like super dying. So this is not the way to go, by the way. If you couldn't tell. what What is hitting me? How am I still getting hit? Because that poison breath goes a lot farther than it looks. Okay. Okay, so that was a mess. Let's try a different spell. How about... No, it's not there. Firewall might work. Ice clad, I want to try. Did that do anything to you? I didn't see... Oh, wait, I guess I'm poisoned, so I'll see easier if I do this. You kind of recoiled, but I think you were just charging up your poison attack. So even here, I'm still taking all the damage and I'm caught on something. Did the way close behind me? No, the hallway just turned. Alright, so Poison Breath has functionally infinite range, so I cannot avoid it, but if I'm farther back, I take less of it. Who knows if that did damage? I have no way to know. Okay, let's try Wind Cutter. Let's aim a little higher, maybe? Okay, a flash red happened, so therefore that probably did damage. Yeah, it goes right through the wall, because of course it does. Okay, one wind cutter per visit here and then take a whole bunch of poison damage is not going to do. But if I can keep you from breathing on me, maybe? So I can't see anything. If you're flashing red, it's impossible to tell because my whole screen is green. You're not flashing red. Am I am I missing? Like what's going on? Am I going too high? Am I going too low? Is the timing just illegal? Does your mouth have to be open and breathing poison? Well, I mean, you took damage then. This seems not doable. Or at least not meant to be done. Like something seems very wrong here. Okay. How about lightning? Oh, my MP bar is not full. Now I'm going to take a whole lot of damage, because poison gets to me no matter where I am. Be struck by lightning. Okay, that did damage, I can tell. You did too, because it's impossible to get away. Okay. I'm out of MP again. All right. This encounter just, like, is not functioning in any way. Like, what is going on? All right, you got lightninged. I run away. It does me no good because that goes through the wall. has infinite range. I'm focusing on just one snake, hoping I can take it out. Oh, my, my bar didn't charge in time. 
Okay, somehow I dodged that poison. There we go, you died. Okay. Is this seriously what I'm supposed to do here? Like, are you are you for real with this? This is this is a parody of an encounter. I think your mouth has to be open, like if you're disappearing, you're invincible. So I do have to summon the Wrath of the Poison Breath. And of course that's close enough to get hit by it. I got the Queen's Staff on. I guess I, I should have the Spider Armband. My MP is low enough that it, the Clarity Bracelet's not relevant right now. Lucky Pendant, can I do better? Oh, this protects from magical attacks. Maybe some of these. Alright, so fine, I'll chomp one of these again. To some extent, I do appreciate that this is this is an RPG that like actually makes me use my resources. I can't just come in here with whatever and get it done without spending anything. Like I have to actually do stuff. Pay a cost in order to do battle. Like conceptually I like that, it's just I don't know about this implementation. What if I stay here? Well, you're dead, so I don't have to anymore. Okay. I could believe there's a better way to do that. But what way that is, is going to remain a mystery to me. So that's a forest fruit, but also a way to go in a hole and not be able to get out. This hole does not distinctly come with a reward, so I'll go down the right one. Am I ready to go down a hole? It doesn't seem like there's anything else to do here, so sure. Okay, down. And where did I see that thing? Here. Uh, okay, nice. I injured my turning muscles. Oh, my turning muscles are injured again. There we go. <laughs> yeah, this one just drops straight down. That one's a gentler drop and comes with a bonus. Okay, let's change equipment again, I suppose. Well, who knows if I'm gonna encounter more poison. Where am I? Well, I dropped down. What could that possibly have accomplished? I don't think I'm in a new location. Like, the symbol of passage is around here somewhere, right? Or... Actually, no, I don't know where I am. Ah! Okay. I'm in a mummy spot. Okay, no, this is new to me. Okay, I need to get out of this room. Alright, so I am somewhere new. Cool. Do I have the Queen's Staff still equipped? I believe I do. Okay. And lightning, I would rather have what? Lightning's fine, but I like Rent Cutter, and I want to level it up. I got cursed, right? No, I got chained up, so I can't magic anymore. Yeah, that's the rainbow curse, right, okay. Okay, my combat strategy there really felt like it shouldn't have worked, and yet, somehow it did. All right, you, yeah, I fought your type before. I don't remember if there's any real trick to it, just, just get in here and do things. So now I'm curse cursed. And I should, oh, do some things about that, maybe. But apparently I'm not. Yet. Probably should. Right, so let's have a, this. And if I, uh, I can heal. I'm gonna need to buy more forest roots. Yeah. And that did the rainbow effect to me, I think. No, the purple effect. You're slowed, that's nice. You got hit by your friend, that's nice for me. Alright, so I'm cursed, I'm just gonna deal with that right now because... Uh, well, I have no MP, so it doesn't matter, and also... You're just gonna recurse me if I fix it. So I'd be wasting my forest fruits. That's not what I would eat to fix it, though. So I'd actually be wasting a forest root. <laughs> So the purple beam doesn't do anything to you, perceptibly to me. 
I think that's just the rainbow curse, isn't it? None of those have landed on me. I guess you're to my left. I guess you were to my left. Most powerful combat move make me have to turn. Basically unbeatable. Okay. Cool. So now I can forest root. Got five left. Where's the rest of the money? There's some of it. There should be two more. Maybe I picked them up without noticing. Here's one more. They're hard to see. Very small coins. Going for realism more than readability. I think this is not the way I came from. I used all my healing water, right? Yeah. Ooh. <laughs> I ate all my herbs too, right? Yeah. I still have many herbal liquids, so I can use those and not worry about it. Oh boy. Okay. So... Uh-huh. That's probably the queen, actually. Thinking about it, that makes sense. I have your staff. I'm not sure I'm ready for a fight with the queen. Let's look at what else is around first. I can probably get it done. Like, I have a lot of stuff in my pockets. I just kind of want to know my territory before I attempt such a thing. This looks like a... Yeah, that's Widow's Door. I may have seen the other side of that, or that could be a different Widow's Door. You might hold the key. Oh, I'm in the mines now. Okay, so you know what? Let's leave the queen alone. Let's see if there's maybe a save and a symbol of passage and a marker here. That'd be real nice. I'm also going to need a way back at some point. Well, a symbol of passage could do that, I suppose. I'm going to need a real way back too, though, in case I had taken all of my marker stones with me. Unless the game just lets that be a loss condition. It could. Oh, look, I found exactly what I wanted. That's nice. Okay. Yellow, guide stone. Perfection. That is exactly where that goes. Okay, first of all, save. Actually, no. First of all, teleport, fill, heal, then save. That makes more sense, because there's no danger doing this as far as I know. Okay. So, crystal vial. Fill this. Oop, fill this. Fill this. Don't eat a dragon flower. Fill that, fill that. Okay. Cool. So, transport to, well, part of where I am. Doesn't get me into the rest of the castle, but I don't think there was any more rest of the castle to explore. I think I saw the whole thing. The snake pit was the last, last thing I needed to explore. Okay, so now... Earned myself a save. That would go here, I guess. All right, let's try that queen. Eggfield, I see. I'm in Eggsfield. Uh, rude, <laughs> you were waiting for me. I'm not 100% sure this is the way I came from. It looks like it, though. So that, I think, was the way to the queen. This was the way to the holes. And at the other side of this is nothing. Okay. And this way is nothing. Okay. Pretty simple layout. Nothing to the side here. Nope, this is the mummy mage combat room. All right, Queenie. Are you going to be just as bad as the snakeheads I just fought? Probably a whole lot worse, I would imagine. So what do those do to me? I avoided finding out. Let's... Uh-huh. 
gonna wait for all of that to load before I can do anything. I have wind cutter equipped. You wanna have a magic battle? Hey, magic power up, that's fun. Let's have a magic battle. I'm gonna use your staff here. See, this is a much more functional magic battle here because you don't have infinite range poison breath. You have stuff I can actually somehow dodge in this narrow little hallway. I feel remarkably safe right now. Also, I can stun lock you? What is this? Oh, this is sad. This is exactly what I'm doing, though. I'm at the perfect distance and uh, timing here. It might take a while, because I don't think Windcutter does much damage. But it does something. And she has no defense against this combat strategy, other than maybe depleting my MP bar. That's so sad. Alright, well, yeah, magic power is going up. Windcutter might level up from this. I'm not counting, but let's just see if this gets it done. I'd say maybe you should try something else, but I could say the same to myself. Maybe I should try something else. But clearly this is working. Like, I'm making progress and she isn't. Not a very interesting way to fight, but it's doing it. I have three healing waters, so I have... Well, that's not four full MP bars. That's like one and a half, two and a half, rather. Now I want to see this level two wind cutter. Like, surely it levels up, right? Oh, oh. oh it has already. It's level two. Okay. Is that what it... That's probably what it meant when it said magic level up. I think it did say that at some point. So that used to be 8 MP. It is now 8 MP. Okay, so leveling up a magic maybe doesn't increase its cost. I still was somehow never sure of that. I don't know how much damage it does. I guess it tells me something about that. 75 wind. Sounds good to me. That's like half a sword hit. I hope she's not just like immune to wind or something. Let's see if any spell that I might replace this with has like extremely higher damage numbers. Ice Clad is more than twice as much damage for less than twice, or also more than twice as much MP, but at a ratio that I think is good. So I think Ice Clad might be the best. Okay, so so what is it? Wind is slightly less than, t or Wind Cutter is slightly less than 10 damage per MP. This one is a lot less. This one is less. This one is more. Fireball's economical. Uh, Fireball hits multiple, though. Flash is a little more economical. Ice Clad looks... Yes, yeah, so this is 12 light damage per MP. Maybe Flash is what I want? Retribution's a little less than 10 per MP. Lightning is much worse. Eclipse is much worse, but it hits multiple. Let's try Flash. She's going to get a chance to attack. That's okay. Does that reach, first of all? Uh, that did not connect. I think I aimed wrong. It's going to the side, so aim left? That's not connecting. Okay, so I'm not hitting with that. Alright, just got to use Wind Cutter then. Okay. Alright, no, you're not allowed to cast, by the way. There we go. That's better. Slice open that stomach. Someday. There we go, I did it. <laughs> that was our fight! That actually just happened. Fancy crystal. What kind of crystal is that? Fire! Okay. 
It's not this kind of magic, it's this kind. Flame breath. Okay. That looks extremely non-efficient. There's probably something to it, though. I assume it's repeated, so it's probably like the poison breath that those snakes had, that I, the big ones that I fought, but... No. It's very expensive for very little power. There's a save here, and a lot of dead things. I'm suspicious of this save. Should I go back for the other one for safety? Well, it's just, just a save. All right. These are just the bones of her enemies. That's the widow's key. I can tell by the way it looks. All right, cool. Got a widow key. All that will do is let me back out of here, though, as far as I can tell, right? Well, now that the queen is dead, let's see what the... Oh, by the way, right, the assistant was somebody I talked to. They probably have a name in here. Who was that exactly? Acriol. All right. Dark Minister serves the way to Queen. Awaits the awakening of the Dark One. Did you say anything of importance to me? Right, yeah, Septigo. The knight was captured. we captured was well-trained. So Septigo is in here somewhere. Right, what was that? Acriol or something? Acriol, yep. Right, I should save after that encounter. There was a save right in there, but I didn't trust it for some reason. I don't know, it looked kind of suspicious. So is this the egg field? Well, this will get me back out to the... No, that's a different widow's door. Okay. Okay, so there are two. So if I find my way back outside... Was this Septigo? Yeah. All right. Well, he's dead. How sad. I got a sword, though. Perhaps the man who lost his sword and was so into Septigo would be interested in this. Can I wield it? Lawful blade. I can. It appears to lack special powers. Okay. Should I really use this? I mean, the stats are pretty good. Okay. How's my crystalline blade doing? Okay. Alright, so how does it swing? It charges fast. I like that. I would happily give this to the guy who lost his sword. But I don't think he's going to take it from me. Okay, so I opened up the door. Now I'm here in the egg field. Let's see how this does in actual combat. Pretty well. I got paralyzed, which is very annoying. I'm gonna wait it out, I think. I can heal while I'm paralyzed. That's nice. Okay, so save is here, I think. Yes. All right, well, I'm just going to save here. Yeah, this is an acceptable way out, but I still do need to get back up there to use the key on the other door. But anyway, I seem to have conquered the palace itself, but the mines below hold more adventuring for me. So next time, I'm going to go out here and see what I can find in this area.